Hi, welcome to this video about uh, conkeys. There was a uh, question on YouTube and there was a question on the forum about the conkeys and about resizing them. So it all matters on what kind of system you are. There are very, very small laptops out there with a very small screen resolution, but also these big guys with 4 HD or how they call it, 4K, and with 1920 on 1080. And that's what it was built for, for a full HD. So if you don't have a big screen, then sometimes these conkeys will be not aligned or a bit too, too big and things are falling off. The thing you need to do is to figure out, first of all, what's the conkey of your choice. It doesn't matter if we're now in open box or, uh, I, or I3, maybe, I don't know, uh, conkeys are not really for tiling window managers, but hey, you're the boss. But let's assume um, Openbox, XFC, Budgie, uh, Gnome, all kind of desktop environment. It does not matter what you're on. You need to figure out how to get to the Conkey. And in Openbox, it's, uh, we have Conkey Zen. We can edit the Conkey. And we have this name here. This name is active. So we could have figured it out with Conkey Zen as well. And we click here. We scroll down and we find it's this one that's active. So I've taken the Nemesis S example. And uh, well, in the forum question, it was also Nemesis. So what you need to know is that the conkeys are in Control H. So the hidden folders are visible. You don't need to know it by heart, but it's uh, interesting that you know it. Show hidden files, Control H. And go to config and in there is a folder conkey and everything that we make and create an update, it's gonna be in here. So we are going to look for Nemesis, and that's this one. So we double click it, we choose maybe what standard application you want to open with it. So open with other application, you choose whatever you want, and you just click here, use as default for this kind of file, and it will always be opened with your uh, preferred editor. So that one is gone. When I work on Conkeys, I usually do something like this. So whatever I change, I'll see immediately to the right. So let's assume that the conkey is not uh, correct in the sense that it's uh, too big on my screen. And I'll just change it. So it is now aligned for the middle right. But it all depends how much height you've given it. So if I give it 500, let's see what happens. With 500, I think something happened. We were a little bit up, didn't we? No, not really. So things don't change really if you change the, the 60, but you could change the cap here and the cap Y. So the X and the I, the Y uh, axis, we can change those. But um, often things are just falling off. That's what was uh, told to me because of the screen resolution is too big. Now, the thing you can do is well this is explained in another tutorial that's why I'm, I'm skipping it so this one is already on articlinux.com what else you can do is uh, figure out where the fonts are and i have to look as well here is a font 11 size source sans pro extra light size 11 so if you make it 10 it should be get, getting a bit smaller sometimes well let's exaggerate let's take it 8 so things are getting smaller in here, as you can see. Some of them are still staying big. That's because we define them in here. So size 18, this one should always be big, so it stays big. So we should, if we could, go for something like this. Control C, Control Find C, and then say Find Me. So here, this one is 10, this one is 12. 12. That is the uptime. So uptime is 12. So if we want to go for a size, if we say Control C, Control H this time, and Control V, and we say everything that's size 12 is going to be size 10. Find me the next one, replace, 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 find me the next one, replace. Still guys there. That's it. I'm saving and I'm watching what's happening. So that's what, what you should do. 
starting to experiment with these things and put them next to each other. Here is still a size 10 for the CPU. Yeah, so if you say lots of size 10s in here, but that's okay. Well, depending on your screen resolution, that's okay. But you have to find out what, what element has been tweaked because the size 18 is still there for Arc Linux, which is okay in my eyes. But there might be other things. So this size equals, control find size equals, then you say, okay, these are all the size 10, this is 8, maybe this is too small. And let's change this back again to 10. And that's how you figure out what to do. And here we say then size 10 as well. So things that are not defined by the by, by a font, then it takes this one. By default, it will be this font if nothing is defined here, but something is defined here. So size 18 takes preference. So it's like uh, CSS if you ever uh, programmed in that. The last one, the, the thing that's nearest to the code will prevail, will win. So this is um, a smaller conky already and it's not in the middle so we could find out why is that so the x let's try with zero zero so this is falling off stuff are falling off to the right if you see it so 10 is is good should be should stay 10 but 20 might be better to say zero so now the difference from the top to this top, not the panel, but the top, this top, and that top is the same. That's how it calculates the difference in the middle of your screen from this line to the top and from that line to the bottom. Now, even if this, this is, that is not enough, you can even go further and say, okay, this Arco Linux is just gibberish, doesn't matter really, so I'm gonna get rid of the Arco Linux nemesis. And then you have a smaller line here. If you say, look, um, that's nice, all these CPU stuff, but I don't have the, the room, so I'm going to delete two of these lines as well for the other guy, the memory, two of the lines, save it again. And you have still have information which are the four uh, largest users of CPU and the four largest users of memory. So that's how you can keep going on. There are packages to be upgraded, as you see here. So 38 need to be upgraded and some processes that are running. Do you really need all this information? So if you're really in, uh, well, don't have the space to put a conky on there, you need to make priorities. Okay, that's enough for conkeys. Um, enjoy your system.